Good day and welcome back to another DBZ Dark Metal video. In this video we're going to be taking a look at the Heroines Edition 4 Extreme Z Battle and this is for obviously Kiyawai and also for uh, the Margarita unit. So pretty straightforward, pretty interesting um, I guess Extreme Z Battle. Most players I don't think will have any major issues with this. It's pretty simple you need to use pepe gals units and ideally you want to use int and tech style units but honestly speaking um it's not the hardest one just taking a friend like if you bring a friend videl then for the most part you'll be pretty much good to go so i really wouldn't concern myself too much with anything uh i honestly think for the most part that this is pretty simple for most players i will be using a fully free to play team pretty much uh, but i wouldn't suggest doing this i mean just use the strongest units you can uh, you can even use kiyawai and margarita and just kind of easy air them as you go along and it's probably for the best but yeah generally speaking that's just kind of where i am uh with this both of them have some pretty cool easy a's uh obviously we'll take a look at them in their own reviews they are pretty interesting units so i'm sure you're going to want to get them and if not just collect the medals for later but collect the stones i mean this hero in addition you know they do tend to stay up they don't go away so much but still i would collect the stones i mean it, it is definitely something that's worth it for you to do so i highly suggest that you do that um other than that that's pretty much it obviously uh from stage 30 or you know up stage 20 onwards things get a little bit more difficult but i'm gonna be honest with you uh for the most part i wouldn't really worry about it uh if you have videl if margarita or kiawai is attacking in the first position um then what i would suggest is you put videl in the first slot so that she can evade and then boost her entire like attack if not then what you can do is look at rather boosting her uh, or putting her in the third slot she gets a huge attack boost and she'll still probably defeat the enemy most times that's pretty much all you need to do uh, there's not a lot else really that matters all the other units won't die or anything they do a little bit of damage so it's not really that big an issue um, overall obviously you know with these uh, generally speaking they tend to be good for easy A's uh, but they tend to be mainly for the Pepe Gals team uh, margarita feels like she's 100 percent for a universe 11 team uh, which you know makes sense i guess to a certain degree so yeah that obviously does matter but besides that i think that's pretty much everything uh honestly there isn't much else i would say uh for me both easy a's are quite solid i do think margarita's looks really really good i think she's definitely a big help for universe 11 um yeah, especially with like Jiren, Topo, stuff like that. I think it is definitely really good to have her um, like overall. I think she's just really nice and, and does a good job. So I am quite impressed with that. Uh, but other than that, yeah, I would say generally speaking, uh, Kiawai also probably another bad easy A. Uh, a little bit more conditional, but she is definitely more a Pepe Gals unit generally. But she does require a little bit on tournament participants. So they're both quite conditional, but they do look really good for that value. So we'll just have to see what happens. But yeah, basically that's it from me. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, leave a like. It's always greatly appreciated. If you need any more help with anything, let me know. Otherwise, yeah, I will see you guys in the next one. So until then, as always, take care, stay safe, and uh, thanks for watching. I will see you guys in the next video. And yeah. Bye.